Hello Visaya, Herman here. If you have ever been to IKEA, you have probably seen this. Fake bots testing the durability of a poang. Well, it's true that if my chair fails, I will get hurt, but without any major consequences. On the contrary, if your devices, your instruments fail, well, that's a different story, and your process and even people could be at risk. We have talked in the past about diagnostics and smart devices and how these features increase the safety and reliability of your devices. But these instruments are actually physical objects that are installed outside and most of the time under really rough conditions. These sensors are exposed to the process conditions with high pressures, high temperatures and process fluids that are corrosive and erosive. We wanted to see how instrumentation suppliers actually make sure that these instruments will work. For this, we took a small trip to Malburg in the south of Germany to see the level switch testing facilities from Endres Hauser. They do all types of tests. For example, they do end of life tests to check how many cycles these devices can last. These tests take months, even years. They expose these devices to different environmental conditions like salt, UV radiation, and high pressure water to check the housings and if these housings would withstand the environmental conditions in places like offshore platforms where heavy rain, sun and salt could damage your devices. They check also the quality of the forefronts for buildup and bending. They check if the sensors work even under these unlikely conditions. So the next time you're sitting on your poang, wondering if your devices will work properly in your application, well, you don't have to worry, since instrumentation suppliers are making sure to stress test these devices before they get to your plant. As always, stay safe. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe and I see you next week.